Good morning, Pamela. Nice to meet you. Thank you. It's nice to meet you too. We seem to have a good connection. I can see and hear you fine. How about you? You sound a bit faint. Let me just adjust the volume. Can you hear me now? Yes, that's much better. Thanks. Okay then. I think we're ready to start. I see from your letter of application that you're interested in applying for one of the hotel animator jobs we have on offer here at Holiday Fun. Could you tell me why you think you'd be suited for a position like this? Well, I believe a job which involves entertaining tourists would give me the opportunity to enjoy my two favorite pursuits: dancing and foreign travel. I see. It says on your CV that you studied contemporary dance. Hotels are always glad to employ dancers. Have you actually done any dancing professionally? I did belong to a dance company, yes, and we used to put on shows regularly. Unfortunately, I had to stop as they started touring all over the country. I couldn't go with them. It was a shame, but I was determined to finish my degree in foreign languages. Ah, uh, yes, a、uh, knowledge of foreign languages is highly desirable for this position. I see you studied Spanish and Italian. Which one do you think you're better at? My Spanish is fluent, and I can get by quite comfortably in Italian as well. Hmm. At the moment, you're working in a travel agency, correct? How long have you been there? Six months. I deal with customers phoning in with inquiries. And didn't you think you might like to rejoin the dance company after you graduated? Well, it did cross my mind, but frankly. It would have been difficult to make ends meet on the salary the dance company was offering. As a hotel animator, you'd be working with the hotel guests not only to entertain them, but also to get them involved in activities too—sports, quiz nights, song and dance competitions, that sort of thing. Public relations is a very important part of the job, in fact. Oh, I'm told I have good people skills. In the third year of my degree, I went to Spain to work as a teaching assistant. I got on extremely well with the children. My role was to motivate them to do their lessons, but I also learnt to be a sympathetic listener, which helped me deal with their individual needs. Well, as your interest in travel, I could offer you a job in Italy at a five-star seaside hotel from June until early September. You'd be part of a team of eight working under an experienced animator. That sounds great. I'm good at water sports too. If that would be a help. Very possibly. Now all our animators are very hardworking. It's an eight-hour-a-day job, six days a week. Would that be a problem for you? No, I don't mind at all. What about accommodation? The hotel provides it free, and three meals a day are included. The salary is eight hundred euros a month. That sounds very reasonable. When exactly would I need to be available to start? The hotel contract is from the first of June. However, we would need to see you here at the agency for two weeks of practice sessions beforehand. That would mean being here on the fifteenth of May. That's fine with me. Is there a fee for the sessions? No, they're free of charge. We'll look forward to seeing you then, Pamela. Shall we? Yes, thank you very much.